In today's highly competitive market, the advertiser must fight to tell an adequate story about his product. Needs enough space to show all his product's features, to tell all its advantages. In print, large-sized ads with dominant illustrations have increased in popularity. A full-page newspaper ad, for example, is about 300 square inches. This is the selling area. The average television screen is about 200 square inches. But there is a big difference between the selling space of television and the selling space of newspapers. In television, you don't just buy one full page. You buy a series of full pages. Each seen in turn, each dominant. We say it. Now let us prove it. Let's start with this print ad. It could be from a magazine or a newspaper. It doesn't matter. Let's use it as a point of departure and apply the vision of television, the revision of print into television. We will use these three highly technical tools. Some plain white cards, a jar of paste, a pair of scissors. Here is what we do. First, we cut from our print ad this picture of the table as a cocktail table. We cut it out and paste it on the first of our white cards. This now becomes the first still of our commercial, the first thing the viewer will see. Now we cut another portion of the print ad and make it panel two. And here's what happens to the rest of the print ad as it becomes a television storyboard. Now we have another dimension we can add as we create this television commercial. The selling dimension of sound. Note that we left behind in the original print ad the blocks of copy. We don't need to waste our television space with them. Remember, in television, we can read our ad to the viewers. We don't require them to read it to themselves. So on top of the physical space, we've added the dimension of sound. Sound plus sight. Here is our storyboard, frame by frame, as it would appear as a television commercial. All the ingredients of the print ad in five times more selling space, with sound on top of the picture. Let's run it as the home viewer would see it. Yes, it's the Castro convertible table, so beautiful and so practical. There are no troublesome leaves to bother with. Nothing whatsoever to store. It's completely automatic. This luxurious cocktail table, which converts to a full-size dining room table seating eight, is made exclusively by Castro. It's the most versatile table ever designed. A table for a hundred uses. Remember, Castro convertibles are priced so low because they're made in Castro's own plants and sold directly to you in Castro showrooms. Castro, showrooms as listed, open evenings, and for your own shopping convenience, there's an easy time payment plan. Simple. Scissors, cards, paste. Try it. As you do, you'll find you have lots of television space left over, space in which to sell more. Looks impressive, but except for the refinements of printing, everything we have done, we could have done years ago. We have still overlooked television's most exclusive selling tool. Motion, action, demonstration. So let's go back to our ad and add motion to it. For the first time in America, and made exclusively by Castro, the Castro Convertible Table. Within seconds, it converts from a compact, luxurious cocktail table to a magnificent full-size dining room table, comfortably seating eight. Yes, it's the Castro Convertible Table. So beautiful, and because of its many uses, so practical. There are no troublesome leaves to bother with, nothing whatsoever to store. It is completely automatic. This luxurious cocktail table, which converts to a full-size dining room table seating eight, is made exclusively by Castro. It's the most versatile table ever designed. A table for a hundred uses. Remember, Castro convertibles are priced so low because they're made in Castro's own plants and sold directly to you in Castro showroom. Castro, showrooms as listed. Open evening. And for your shopping convenience, there's an easy time payment plan. That's what can happen when you start with a print ad. Let's see what you can do if you start with television. The TV camera is an outstanding instrument of creativity. It is limited only by your imagination. If you cannot outspend your competition, maybe with a TV camera you can outvision him. Back in the days of print, we used to say, don't just say your product is good, show it is good. 
In television, we add to this saying. Now we say, don't just show it is good, prove it is good. If you follow this one rule, your television will be more effective and you will use more television. If you say your product gets clothes clean, don't just say it, show it. And don't just show it, prove it. Look at this simple technique. Here is what a camera can do with some simple dots. Suppose these dots were the fibers of a dress cleaned in your product. As the camera pulls back, we can see how clean they are. How fine the texture is. How bright the pattern. How well the fit. Look at the apparently clean dress washed in brand X. And keep looking right in until you see those dirty fibers. Sound impractical? Here's someone using this technique on TV right now. Same way with these two shirts. This one looks clean, but under this microscope, this shirt washed with the kind of product millions use shows piled up soil, and soil can cause odor. But this shirt washed with modern fab is clean, clear through. Watch how fab gets out soil less effective wash day products leave behind. See? Clean, clear through. They said it was clean, showed it was clean, proved it was clean. 